Oh, look. We've reached 10,000 views. Thanks, everyone. Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. This is Forgotten Camel, and welcome to another Medieval Engineers Today tutorial. Excuse me. Today, we are going to talk about how to build a catapult in survival mode. Okay? Of course, if you want to build this, just build a plain one, you can, like, skip a couple of minutes, because this is kind of... I'm going to be a little bit more in-depth. Now, first off, I think you sh ought to research... Uh, weaving because uh, the catapult does require rope, including this one. You need this one needs rope. This is this is like the mechanics is the building blocks for building rope. We you should also uh, just in case get farming because it makes it easier to get uh, or to get things like flax and such because you need flax. You really really need to have flax straws in order to get this. Uh, that being said, uh, let's go ahead and craft this one and consume it. Then after that we gotta go get some rope. So I'll be uh, I'll be right back real quick. Uh, I gotta uh, let's go down to the place where we can get some rope. So I don't know how much I'm going to craft. Let's uh Craft four, I guess. And then with this we can make a lot of basic rope, actually. Whoops. I need more lining. Sure, I have two... Oh. Didn't realize that it didn't cancel. Okay, now we can make more rope. Okay, that done. Let's take the rope. And I still have to get some other materials, so I'll be right back. Quick reminder, uh, be sure you have blacksmithing or something like... I, th I think it's called blacksmithing. Be sure you have that research because, yeah, you need 10 iron ingots, as you probably could have seen. So right now I have four. Let's uh, smelt several more. Oh, those sticks go by faster than usual. Okay, yeah, that should be everything. So we got 10 iron ingots, uh, 10 timber, and 15 rope. Okay, so how uh, to get that, you need ironworks, metal hardening, uh, carpentry, of course, and weaving. Don't forget wheel running. You definitely, well, yeah, don't forget wheel running. Because if, if, if you want a moving one anyway so let's craft this and consume it and now we can go to locking catch box and torsion string uh because yeah this is base this is the basics but we need advanced mechanics and then after that we should be able to uh do what we need of course, this is not much different from the last one, so you need to get 10 iron ingot, 15 timber, 10 ropes, yada yada yada. I got a lot of junk on me. But anyway, let's uh, let's get what we need real quick. And remember, iron hammer, you need to get a smithy. Okay, I think I finally got uh, what I need here. All right. Now we should be able to start building. I don't remember whether I uh, get the stone or not. So we gotta go to our crafting table. Yeah, we can get our large projectiles. So we can get our large projectiles. We need wheels, I believe. 
wheels, catch blocks, maybe locking catch block. Although, well, not necessarily. I liked it. Uh, but where is this? There's this thing that you need for rope that can hold it. Can't find it in here. Okay, I found it. You need uh, the rope eye plate. So uh, I suggest getting four. Of course, this thing already gives you five. But yeah, get like four of these. And there's a reason for that. If you're going to build a catapult with wheels, you need something to hold it down. Which means you'll need a lot of timber. Alright, so <clears throat> get some timber to spare. Get the torsion spring, and uh, and there are there is going to be a lot of back and forth here, to just to gather the materials and everything else. Just it, it's it's a lot to do. You had to go out, far, uh, gather more equipment, build some equipment to build more equipment. Or not equipment, but more build an item to build what the item that you need. Uh, let's put this in here. So I need catch blocks. See, this takes a lot of work. Don't forget the hand crank, crank wheel. Okay, I got a lot of junk on me uh, to build these catch blocks. So one torsion spring, two catch blocks, so I need to build about, how many catch blocks? Six, I think? Yeah. I completely, uh, forgot. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to need some, I, I think I'll want a locking catch block and some wooden sticks, just in case. I don't know, i would never... Uh, I've never done a the rope drum without the locking catching catch block, but just uh, just just in case, because I don't want it running off. Holy cow! Got a lot of junk on me. Okay, uh, yeah, six catch blocks. I I got two just in case. Actually, you don't need two. You just need one. But can't forget to build the catapult uh, bucket and then the wheels we need four wheels of course quick tip guys do not uh, don't use large stones or large projectiles for your catapults because the catapult will be extremely ineffective and I'll, I'll show you in a sec let's just build one of these and then build two of these ah crap I can't take that with me oh well I still need rope um I'll take that out put this in yeah I'll get more tools later okay now we should be able to build a catapult. I went the wrong way. But yeah, let's build the catapult right now. Um, Alright then, let's go ahead and I guess put it right here. And uh, I already have one built, but this is... Uh, my version. Let's hope that's right. No, that is... That is very wrong. That is... Extremely wrong. What in the world? Take that back. Put this back on here. Well, will we'll that do it? Let's turn this around just in case. Okay. So, uh, yeah, it's facing this way, which means I gotta turn. I gotta build my. I think I'm a bob right here. 
I got it back. Oh, why can't I get this on here? Okay. So you can build it any way you want. I think I'll put this in the center. And uh, let's build our little catch block over here. And there are several variants that you can get. So if you want a different variant, uh, use the scroll wheel, the mouse scroll wheel to uh, get the one you want. What? I, I need to scroll out a little. Uh, I don't know if that's right or not, but uh, it's going to have to do. And I'd like to keep this a little bit low. Now, this is technically me experimenting because I've already built several catapults, but I want to experiment a little. And uh, let's get our rope drum and this one has several variants uh, as well so change it to lockable rope drum it is imperative that you change it to lockable rope drum or otherwise your catapult's not going to work right at all uh, it's 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 just going to be a mess when you're trying to use it so let's get this on there if it'll let me And you just press F on it to get it to activate. I just realized that I do not have my, uh, yeah, I don't have my will. For some reason, I have two catapult buckets. Why do I have two catapult buckets? I don't know. But I need to get my crank, so I'll be right back. Okay, it took me an awful long while, but I finally got what I needed. So let's get the, this, I think, over here. It has to be spread, cord a little bit so the hand crank doesn't uh, touch the wheel. So let's get this onto here. That looks ridiculous. But it's spinning all right. Whoops. Okay. I'm starting to think I went a little bit too far uh, with this thing right here. What on earth is that sound? Anyway, let's go ahead and build the catch blocks that I need right over here. Two-sided catch block. Yeah, that's not gonna cut it. Yeah, let's go uh, get 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 get. Ah, this darn thing. I should raise this a little higher. Okay. Maybe a little bit awkward. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to put my wheels on now. Oh wow, that is dangerously close to the ground. In fact, that's going to attach to the ground. Trying to make sure this thing can move. I'm going to have to remove that. Okay, that one moves. This one's fine. This one's also a mess. Completely 
completely forgot that I needed to add this. Yeah, don't forget to add the round timber at the center. To prevent any problems from arising. Okay. And, uh, I need stairs to reach this here. Because this thing is awful high. Yep, I need stairs. Yeah, I need a lot more timber. I don't have enough. There we go. Now we need to add our rope eyes. Okay, I'm out. To the end there, okay. With that, we should be able to attach the rope onto here. But we cannot forget that I need... <sighs> this is a really weird design that I just made. My, my last design was much better than this one, but this is just like a tutorial, so... And now I need more timber. Don't necessarily need that, but I'm going to keep that there just in case. Okay, I finally got timber. This is, uh, this thing is really getting on my nerves. Not even let me get it on there. Alright. That should do it. Okay, there's a reason why I put this here, by the way. I'll get that reason later. So, um, yeah, this should be finished, but... Uh, hang on. Completely forgot. So, one, two, three. I need some extra rope eyes. What I'm doing here is I'm putting in uh, some things to secure the catapult. Because it's a wheeled catapult. And it requires uh, something to hold it down. So, that's why I got more than one bit of rope. And, some other things. So, let me get more rope eyes. Alright, now that our catapult is finished, the design and everything, uh, let's go ahead and release the thing at the center here. What on earth? Oh, that is so weird. When it makes that sound, it scares the hell out of me. It really scares me, because it makes me think something's breaking. So let's remove this one. Oh, it actually went down for a change. Uh, I want to turn on the locking me mechanism. Can't turn on. <laughs> can't, can't, can't touch it. I really can't touch it. Oh, uh, that's unfortunate. Oh well. So uh, let's lock this up first because I don't want it moving and that's too high and this over here okay you see what I'm doing you see how you do it attach these together and then uh, had to touch this. Ah, I can reach it. Good. And connect to there. Okay. Now press press F. And first, I will show you the reason why you don't use the large projectiles. And hopefully, I can get this on here correctly. I keep missing it a lot. I can make a video of the times I keep missing the catapult bucket. This thing is huge. Okay, I got it on there. So press F on the rope drum and it will release. Yeah, you see... Oh. I just remembered. Yeah, you have to put in a block here in order for it to shoot properly. Shoot. 
I keep skipping a lot of steps today. Maybe I'm tired, maybe? I don't know. But I'm going to have to go find that uh, ball. Okay, this was one of the most important things that I was supposed to mention to you. You put this on here, at any place on here, and it, it'll adjust where your ball goes. It's like where you want your ball to go. And you put that on... Uh, I guess I'll put it... I'll put it, uh, I mean, this is technically the center. It's like closest to the thing, but we want it going nice and up. So I'm going to put this one right on here. It, this is really hard to do when you're not in uh, creative mode. Okay. And put that on there. There. Yeah. Do not forget this. I did. You just don't forget this. I I have a very poor memory, and it, this thing just went down again. Okay. Now let's show a proper uh, presentation for the cut bolt. And of course, uh. Uh, that's the reason why you don't use the large ball, because it does not have very much force. However, for the small projectile, and I believe this is basically what the small the, the catapult is meant for, but you put in small projectiles onto the catapult, and it doesn't really... Uh, that's my dog barking, but it, it doesn't really do much damage, but... I suppose. I suppose you can run away then. No, 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 come back! Come back! Oh. Like, this catapult does not want to be friends with me today, does it? Okay. Do not run off. Alright, now let me show you this firing. And look how far it went! Wow, you didn't even see it. And it landed. And it did very well. And I'm not gonna throw it, I'm not gonna shoot at any of my buildings, because I worked hard building those. But yeah. There is your tutorial for how to build a catapult in survival mode. So I hope this was helpful. If it was, and uh, please Share this video to others, and also if you liked the video, please like and subscribe. And, uh, I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching this tutorial, and have a good day. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother.